Before we get started, I'd like to clarify. This discussion is about a man named Stetson Hardwick, also known as Arum Linkaya. Now, I know I'm not pronouncing that name correctly, and honestly, I don't give a fuck, but that's not the point. Stetson recently partook in two debates. One with Gage the Doom Guy, where Damien Skyfire, Athena the Guitarist, and Jennifer Vanilla sat in to watch. And another with Cass Warfox, where I acted as a guest and Gage the Doom Guy was a moderator. From my experience watching both debates, and sitting in on Cass's debate with his royal fishiness, I've seen Stetson act like an overgrown toddler when they disagreed with him. Everything he said was either entirely untrue or was heavily twisted out of context for the purpose of shaming the opposing party. The way Stetson always handled such disagreements, he would always, and I do mean always, resort to using arguments that do not tie into the topic. This is not how you handle an actual debate, Stetson. When you engage in a debate with someone, you are supposed to stay on point and only debate the topic at hand. During both debates, he repeatedly tried to make himself look like a victim. This, however, was counterproductive. All it really did was annoy Stetson's opponents and the audience. When all you do is make people angry only to cry victim afterwards, all you're really doing is giving everyone a reason to not like or trust you. Stetson even openly admitted to stalking Jennifer Ranilla, but quickly denied it when Cass called him out on it. This is the kind of person we're dealing with. And believe me, I use the word person very loosely. If you really want to handle a debate, Magikarp, you'd be willing to listen to what people have to say instead of trying to cut them off. Another thing you don't want to do during a debate is ignore the facts and call it fake news. Here's the thing, Stetson. You openly slander people with no understanding of how it makes you look. If you have no respect for the truth, then you have no right to tell people that you are telling the truth. When you make it a point to slander people every chance you get, other people make it a point to call you out on it because of, the, because of what you said. Excuse me. If you want to talk shit about people, the least you could do is make sure your claims are true. Otherwise, you look like an idiot. After every lie you make, every re you spout, and every other crappy thing you've done, all you will accomplish is utter self-destruction. You've screwed yourself, and you have nobody to blame but yourself. You even attempted to DD your ass cast, so what the hell was with that? I know you're a retard and can't argue, but DDoSing someone is bad. You didn't win the debate by doing that. All you did was make yourself look like a coward. Oh, and another thing. Why did you, why did you try to compare Athena and I to Jennifer and call all three of us fake transgenders? If you don't know who you're talking about, don't try to address them. That's just my experience with Stetson. As far as I know, Cass and the others have been talking about Stetson and debating with him for over a year now, and he doesn't know when to fucking go away. He never does. And every single time somebody debates with him or talks about him, he just spams their comments section with God, what, a million comments? Maybe. All I'm saying is, fuck Stetson. I'm pretty much done. Thank you guys so much for listening to me ramble about this retarded fish. I'll link Gage and Cass's debates in the description below so you can check those out and watch the ever-living batshit insanity, as I call it, that is Stetson Hardwick. Thanks again so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.